Actress Carol Lindley, known for her role in the Poseidon Adventure, faced an interesting challenge during the film's production. Despite her later claims of singing the morning after, her voice was, in reality, dubbed by studio singer Rene Armand. A surprising revelation considering the iconic nature of the song in the film. Beyond her cinematic endeavors, Lindley shared a close friendship with legendary actor, dancer Fred Astaire. Rumors of a potential marriage circulated in the late 1970s, but in June 1980, Astaire married someone else, leaving fans and the media speculating. Lindley's insights into their relationship are documented in the book Fred Astaire, his friends talk by Sarah Giles, shedding light on a chapter in her personal life. During the production of The Poseidon Adventure, Lindley faced physical discomfort. She owned the boots and pendant worn in the film but complained about the boots shrinking due to constant immersion in water, causing significant discomfort. This behind-the-scenes struggle adds a layer of realism to her portrayal in the disaster classic. In conclusion, Carol Lindley's career is marked by both on-screen successes and off-screen connections. The dichotomy between her claimed vocal contribution and the dubbed reality, her friendship with Fred Astaire, and the physical challenges she endured during filming all contribute to the intriguing narrative of this accomplished actress. Unveiling the stories behind the scenes offers a fresh perspective on a Hollywood talent whose experiences went beyond what audiences saw on the screen. Born to Francis Fuller and Cyril Roland Jones, an Irish emigrant from Kerry, Carol Lindley's early years were marked by her attendance at a professional children's school in New York. Alongside fellow child models Sandra Dee and Tuesday Weld, she frequently graced the pages of the American Girl magazine. In a memorable collaboration, the trio, along with another top New York child model, Lorna Gilliam, even featured together in an advertisement for Canada Dry Ginger Ale. Later in her career, Lindley teamed up with entertainment reporter Nelson Aspen for various showbiz segments. Notably, on Australia's one morning show Sunrise, she shared insights on the remake of the Poseidon Adventure. Her appearances on TV Guide Television delved into her extensive career in television, film, and Broadway. In a segment titled News with Nelson, Lindley revealed her Oscar picks for the year and named Frank Sinatra as her all-time favorite Oscar winner. Beyond the glitz of show business, Lindley's roots traced back to Suffolk, Massachusetts, through her mother, Frances Fuller. Meanwhile, her father, Cyril Roland Jones, hailed from Ireland, adding a touch of cultural diversity to her heritage. This multifaceted glimpse into Carol Lindley's life, from her early days as a child model to her insightful moments on screen and off, unveils the layers of a talent whose impact reached beyond the cinematic frame. Featured on the April 22, 1957 cover of Life magazine, Carol Lindley caught the eye of Walt Disney, leading to her debut in The Light in the Forest. Paired with Broadway actor James MacArthur, their performances garnered mixed reviews due to the polarized opinions on Disney's studio. Despite this, it marked both her introduction and farewell to Disney's realm. Beyond Disney, Lindley's life unfolded with nuances, including an 18-year off and on affair with David Frost. Upon her passing, she chose cremation, with her ashes finding a final resting place in the Pacific off California's coast. This multifaceted journey from a Disney debut to complex personal connections paints a vivid picture of Carol Lindley's life and legacy. Jill Selsman, born on March 2, 1962, is the only child of Carol Lindley and her ex-husband Michael Selsman. While Lindley's professional life is well documented, her personal journey as a mother adds a compelling layer to her legacy. Balancing a career that started with Broadway performances, including notable roles in The Potting Shed and Blue Denim, Lindley navigated the demands of both the modeling world and the theater from a young age. Her commitment to her craft and family sheds light on a lesser known aspect of the actress life. Despite the challenges in her personal life, Lindley's dedication to her daughter remained steadfast. The complexities of being a Broadway performer while simultaneously managing the responsibilities of motherhood offer a glimpse into Lindley's resilience and determination. The dichotomy of her life on and off the stage, juggling modeling commitments and theater performances while raising her daughter, presents a nuanced perspective on the acclaimed actress. Beyond her familial roles, it's noteworthy that Lindley, despite her own stardom, was an admirer of fellow actress Cameron Diaz. 
Her fondness for Daya's work, particularly citing There's Something About Mary as one of her favorite films, adds an interesting layer to Lindley's taste in cinema. This connection between two actresses from different eras in Hollywood provides a unique angle to explore Lindley's personal interests beyond her own career. In conclusion, delving into Carol Lindley's life as a mother and her admiration for contemporary actresses like Cameron Diaz reveals a more comprehensive understanding of the actress beyond her cinematic achievements. The intersection of her professional and personal life, marked by Broadway success and motherhood, along with her appreciation for modern cinema, paints a vivid picture of a multifaceted talent whose impact reaches far beyond the spotlight. As the curtain falls on our tribute to a luminary of the silver screen, let's take a moment to bask in the timeless glow of actress Carol Lindley's cinematic legacy. Whether you were spellbound by her grace or moved by the depth of her performances, one cannot deny the indelible mark she left on the tapestry of entertainment. Now, dear reader, it's your turn to step into the spotlight. Reflect on the scenes that resonated with you, the characters that lingered in your thoughts long after the credits rolled. Invite the echoes of Carol Lindley's artistry to dance through the corridors of your memories. What moments etched themselves into the canvas of your cinephile heart? In this shared space of admiration, let the dialogue flow. Your words have the power to weave a collective ode to a talent that transcends time. Unveil your musings, unveil your cherished fragments of connection with the on-screen magic spun by an artist who graced our lives with her presence. As we join hands in this celebration of cinematic wonder, we extend our heartfelt appreciation for the enduring impact actress Carol Lindley has etched into the annals of entertainment. The stage may dim, but the resonance of her performances remains illuminated in the hearts of those who've been touched by her art. Thank you for lending your ears and thoughts to this homage, dear reader. Your participation enriches the narrative and ensures that the flickering flame of Carol Lindley's brilliance continues to illuminate our collective appreciation for the art of storytelling.